Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Diane again, and I want to talk to you this week about something very exciting. I want to talk about rainbow art. Rainbows are a spectrum of colors that appear when light hits raindrops, very, very small raindrops, and they blend together like this. So you can see the spectrum and how it combines. But when we talk about it, we say it's seven colors. And who decided on the seven? The Greeks. Aristotle decided that we would say a rainbow is seven colors. Sometimes we say six, whoops, but mainly we say seven. There's red, orange, yellow, green, blue, then a color a lot of us don't know, indigo and violet, which we also call purple. So the way to remember the order of them is to think of Roy G. Biv. And there's a song about Roy G. Biv that's a lot of fun to listen to. I'm gonna post it for you so that you can listen to it. But Roy G. Biv helps you on remember the order of the rainbow, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. So where do we see rainbows in art? This image here is from a cave painting 2000 to 4000 BC, and it is thought to be the earliest art image of a rainbow. Where else do we see rainbows? Well, when you look at the ceiling of church, almost always there is a rainbow around Jesus. And that reminds us of God's promise. Sometimes the rainbow on the ceiling of the church is not all the colors of the rainbow, um, but it is a rainbow. Let's show you some others. Here's a painting from the 1800s, very typical of a uh, landscape and it includes a rainbow. Here is Kandinsky. Remember him? We did the abstract non-objective art. And here is a Kandinsky, and he included a rainbow in his abstract art. Here, whoops, here is an eye. And somebody did this eye, not in its regular colors, but in rainbow. And finally, ta-da, you know who that is? I've got a picture of her in my classroom, Mona Lisa. But here, somebody did Mona Lisa using rainbow. And here finally is a cat wearing glasses. And look at him, he's got rainbow going all across him. So. For our project this week, I thought you would draw something, anything at all, and I would like you to color it in Roy G. Biv rainbow colors. Let me show you what I mean. Here, yes, Teeny, I will start with your picture today. Teeny drew a picture of Teeny. But instead of making himself green, he colored himself Roy G. Biv rainbow colors. Here is a picture of a dog that I drew. And I used chalk and I blended it so I could get like the spectrum of colors. And I put some polka dots around him. Here's a flower my son drew. And here, is a whale my daughter did. So your project for this week is to draw whatever you would like to draw, use whatever materials you would like to use, and then color it in rainbow order. Now, you can add an actual arced rainbow to your picture, but I would like you to draw something that normally is not rainbow, and make it rainbow. And if you wanna do a unicorn, I know some of you do, you can do that as well. Okay, have a great week and um, 
Happy creating. Take care. Bye. Bye.